and 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 I do think this is a very serious time. I'm not anti-Christian or anti-religion, but you know, if, if the 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 way people are talking about Christianity and how this government should be governed by Christian ideals, and that we need to weed out those people that are examples of unchristian or uh, uh, you know or immoral behavior or uh, that that's very dangerous language and it may seem like it's coming from a good place but that language can be exploited and it's a very dangerous language and i and 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 obviously people react when when this name is brought up but if you look at old speeches from from people like Hitler or Idi Amin, yeah. and they talk about for the greater good, for righteousness, for you know the to we have to, to fight ungodliness. That is a precursor to potentially terrible, terrible, terrible times because you're listening to ideas of one small group, and that one small group is being exploited by the ideas of even a smaller group. And it, it brings it brings people into the mar it brings people from the margins into the mainstream, but it also takes the mainstream into margin margin marginal ideas and the, the ideas that should be marginalized, like um, speaking for God or or speaking for what is right or speaking for the judgment, being the judge of God, uh, for on God's behalf. It is those that those kind of that's terrible, terrible terrible rhetoric and it and it's terrifying to me because i it does it's these kind of things don't happen slowly we have to be vigilant in this country to prevent ourselves from falling into the hands of people that will that will that will not allow it to come back without a much more desperate fight than the one we're having right now absolutely yeah. man and if when you analyze the language it's terrifying yeah. Truly, because we've seen this movie before, I mean, throughout history, as you mentioned, it's just crazy. And I'm so glad that you're here to chime in on it. Right. Morality is not something, is, as soon as morality becomes a tool to exclude people or include a f small percentage of people and to oppress people because they are viewed as immoral or wrong, as soon as that happens, as policy, things begin to crumble. And, you know, unfortunately, very often in those, in those instances, the people, the minority, the radicals, the, that don't like to be called radicals, are much more eager to do harm and much more eager to pull triggers and uh, commit violence. And it's just, it's just something that we shouldn't, we should do more than hope um, will go away. And even if it's our drowning hope, we should do more with it than without it.